Are you looking for a way to add more people and more customers into your business? Hey guys, my name is Chef Katrina and hang around for a few minutes. I want to share with you four words that I've learned that can help you put in a hundred new customers into your business every single month. So one of the things I'm reading right now is a launch formula about basically how to get people involved or excited about being in your business and your opportunity. And this applies whether you're a brick and mortar business, a network marketing business, or a home-based business. These four words really do have a powerful effect on how you're building your business. The first word I want to share with you guys is the word called authority. And we all stumbled around this. We all think, hey, I'm not an authority figure. I don't know a lot of information. People aren't going to trust me. But authority is really easy to create. It's actually a person perception more so than having a great expansion of knowledge. So authority can be if you're a brick and mortar business, say you're a restaurant order, you could be the authority in how a burger is cooked or how French fries are cooked or how something that you want it be to be perceived in your business. You can say, well, the reason you should come to my restaurant is because I can show you step by step how to do something. So it's about creating authority. It's about creating the illusion or impression that you know a lot of information, which you probably do. The uh, One of the other factors is with a network marketer is creating authority is really about empowering and helping your team. So you can create authority by saying, I can show you, teach you how to build your downline. I can show you how to use this business, how to pocket an extra hundred bucks a month. So as long as you're able to show and teach your downline how to do something, you actually increase that authority figure in your business. And it makes it easier to recruit people because they see you as somebody that has something that they want. So authority is a very powerful tool and it doesn't require a lot from you. And a good example of this one where I was just reading through this book was that there was a, a they're all leaving this, this football game and traffic was all piled up and uh, this, his friend next to him jumps out of his car, right? Grabs this like flashlight and basically, you know, if you've ever gone to a theme park or like that, it's like, you know, the flashlight directing him through traffic, helping him guide him through and people were moving out of the way and, and, and you know, getting out of the way or, and following that traffic pattern because they just saw somebody with a flashlight and they assumed that they knew what they were doing or where they were going. And because of that, we're directing traffic, uh, they just followed the lead. So authority can be really a perception of anything that you do out there. So I just want to talk with you about authority, more or less a perception. And all you have to do is take action to really create that authority out there. Start telling people what you know and how you can better serve them. The second one is reciprocity. Reciprocity. Uh, this is that when you give value and you help more people, in turn, they're going to want to help you, right? So if you're out there and you're educating people and you're showing people how to do things and how to build a business and you're in action and you just care more about the success of other people, in turn, there's going to be this feeling of like, well, how can I pay you back for this? How can I help you and how can I work better more with you in building your business so reciprocity is a really powerful word that you can start using today in the actions of helping and empowering more people to get what they want the third one is trust and trust can be easily made and easily broken but again when you provide value and you're really upfront with people and you're like hey this is who I am this is how I can help you and you start providing education and training and knowledge and that trust begins to build right so if you have a, a brick and mortar establishment and they walk through your door taking care of them from the moment they walk in by greeting them making them feel that you know that they're that because they're in the door that you're going to help them with whatever they need to be there whatever they need in their service right it's not about you making the quick buck it's actually about providing again a service for them helping them and that is a trust factor. When you can provide information, when you can empower other people, you begin to build that trust factor. The last one that I really love, this is actually four out of eight words that we talk about in this book that I just referenced called The Launch by Jeff Walker. And that is anticipation, right? So anticipatory. So when you're coming out with a product or you're about to launch something or you're about to get into your business, the idea is that, you know, hey, I'm putting a team together right now, I'm getting people in place, and I'm just trying to figure out what's going to be best for everybody. That's a lot about anticipation. It's the expectation that something's about to happen. So interesting thing enough, like as a network marketer, you can create anticipa anticipation uh, by bringing people onto your team and letting them know that you're going to be doing a future training or a future 
um, help with them. So you're going to show them exactly what they need to do to start building your business, but it requires them starting now with you before you, you even tell everybody else in the world that you're getting into this business. And that's really creating this sense of anticipation. Like I'm on the inside secret. There's something that's about to happen. I can't wait to get into this. Same thing goes with a restaurant. So maybe you're coming out with a new dish. Maybe you're coming out with a new item on your menu. You can create that same sense of anticipation and have people waiting and, and, and not, you know, ready to come in the door on the day of when you release this new dish, this new appetizer, whatever it is. Same thing goes if you're a real estate agent, if you've got a new property, say, hey guys, I just stumbled across this property that's coming to me. Really excited to, to share this with you guys. If you guys want the insider secret, of you know this new place is coming on market and only a few of you guys are gonna be able to get your hands on this for this ridiculous price. You start creating that anticipate and anticipate anticipation. Well, if I could speak today, I would uh, for this offer out there. So four really key words, guys, and I'm gonna recap real quick. It's creating authority, and authority is a lot about being per a perception. So learning, valuable education, teaching, empowering, and training. Those are all purposeful pieces of. Um, building authority. Reciprocity, so going out there and helping and over-delivering in value, over-delivering on that customer service, building that, so number three is trust, so really creating that trust, creating that bond that if you're going to ask for this, I'm going to provide you with this. And last but not least, number four, anticipata an anticipation, wow, anticipation about something that's coming out. So we're really creating that excitement beyond it. So these are four really powerful words that if you can start implementing this into your business, you can be bringing in a hundred new customers into your business every single month by being excited, by being educational, by sharing information and knowledge and becoming an authority that's going to create reciprocity, that's going to create trust, and that's going to share and let people know and anticipate and, and, and be hanging on your every word to try to get into your opportunity, into your business, or buy your product or service. So I hope you guys found value with this today's training. If you did, go ahead and Share this training video. If you're on my blog, go ahead and share this blog out there with everybody. This is a really powerful way to build that 100 customer a month business. and so simple to transform your business in that. So again, my name is Chef Katrina. Visit me over at thechefkatrina.com to learn more about my training and how I can better serve you in building your business today. We'll talk to you soon.